Welcome to Arlington National Cemetery. Tomorrow is the start of the two-day flower ceremony for the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier Centennial Commemoration. For the first time in nearly 100 years, the public will have the opportunity to walk across the tomb plaza and lay a flower of their choice at the base of the tomb. The first thing you'll want to do is make sure you're registered on Eventbrite. You can sign up for any time that is available between 9 a.m. and 4 p.m. The second thing you're going to want to determine is what type of flower you'd like to bring. You are permitted one flower of any kind per person, but please no bouquets or wreaths. Now, if you didn't bring a flower, then that is okay. Roses, Gerber daisies, carnations, and sunflowers will be distributed by volunteers near the tomb. So now let's talk about how you're going to get here. You have a few different options to access the cemetery, and we encourage you to take public transportation. This is the main entrance on Memorial Avenue. You can access this by taking the Metro to the Arlington Cemetery stop, or you can drive and park in our Welcome Center parking garage. This is your best option if you're looking for minimal walking, as the Arlington Cemetery Metro stop is the closest to our Welcome Center and the tram. If you're walking from the Roslyn Metro stop, then you can enter here at the Orden Wetzel Gate. This is near the U.S. Marine Corps War Memorial, and this gate is about a 10 minute walk to the Welcome Center and the trams. If you're coming from either the Pentagon or the Pentagon City Metro stop, you're going to want to walk through the 123 service complex gate. This is about a 20 minute walk down Eisenhower Drive to the Welcome Center and the trams. Now, if you're a DOD ID card holder, then you can enter the cemetery through the Old Post Chapel gate on Joint Base Meyer Henderson Hall. This entrance is also for those walking. However, if you use this gate, then your best option is to walk to the tomb instead of taking the tram from the Welcome Center. Please know that this is about a 25 minute hilly walk from the Old Post Chapel gate to the tomb. Now, if you're a family pass holder, the Old Post Chapel gate and the main entrance on Memorial Avenue are going to be your only vehicle access points for the next few days. But no matter what gate you choose to enter Arlington through, please remember to bring a government issued ID for the initial security screening. We encourage you to take the tram from the Welcome Center to the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. Because of the centennial, all tram rides to the Memorial Amphitheater are free. The flower ceremony event and the trams are both ADA accessible and stroller friendly. Once you arrive by tram to the tomb, please follow any signs you may see or directions from cemetery staff. We've incorporated a few special experiences for you while you're waiting in line to pay your respects. At one or two locations, you'll see cemetery historians stationed to share the tomb's history and connections directly with you. You'll also see signs with facts about the tomb around the Memorial Amphitheater area. Also on Facebook and Instagram stories, we'll be sharing interactive quizzes, puzzles, and different types of engaging content to educate you on the go. Once you've reached the tomb, please have the flower of your choice with you or a volunteer will provide you with one. In this once in a lifetime event, you will be able to walk across the plaza and lay your flower near the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. This moment is for you and all unknowns only known but to God. We do hope that each and every person that chooses to participate in the flower ceremony has a respectful and meaningful experience, and therefore, please no selfies. If you would like to have your photo taken, then please have another visitor capture your moment from the exit area. When you're ready, the tram will take you back to the Welcome Center, or you can choose to explore Arlington National Cemetery and walk from here. We look forward to seeing you over the next few days. Up-to-date information about the flower ceremony will be shared on our social media at ArlingtonNATL, hashtag Tomb100.